What's up, you wrestling fanatics and friends? You're listening to the True Wrestling Podcast, episode 83. Thanks for tuning in. I recently had a conversation with head wrestling coach of the Princeton Tigers, Chris Ayers. Coach Ayers and I talk about the ongoing world championships, Princeton wrestling, the RTC, girls wrestling. Thanks for tuning in. We cover a lot. I'd like to thank my sponsor, Adidas Wrestling. You can check them out at adidaswrestling.com. You can follow uh, Princeton on two different Twitter addresses, at Tiger Wrestling and at Princeton Wrestle. Maybe Coach Ayers will clarify which one you're supposed to really follow. You can also follow him at Tiger Coach Ayers, A-Y-R-E-S. Without further delay, here is our conversation. Here with head Princeton wrestling coach, Chris Ayers. Coach, we've gone back, uh, I don't know, I think I, I showed up at your first match when maybe you had one dual meet win, been following you for the last several years, maybe it was more than that. I think you actually made fun of me saying, what am I doing covering the program? <laughs> I haven't seen you in a while, it's good to talk to you, it's good to see you. It's good to see you too, really good to see you. It's been, it's been quite a while, we've been, in, uh, we've been in hibernation, so we're ready to come out. Uh, well, we're talking as the men's freestyle world championships are going on. Uh, I know you're watching. You want to talk a little bit about the RTC uh, and yeah. just your thoughts on the world championships right now. I mean, U- USA is amazing. They're doing such a good job. Um, we have Jaden Cox out there. He took a bronze. I know it's not what he wanted, uh, but it's good to get get us get ourselves a little bit of a world medal there. So that's good. Uh, it's a little slow in the match he lost, and I think he probably feels the same way. Uh, but USA, it, you know, they're pumping on all cylinders. It was so good to see us get some gold medals with Thomas Gilman, and Dake, and Burrow. So, uh, yeah, we're, we're doing a good job. I was going to say we're crushing it, but I think we're in second, actually. So we're not crushing it that good. But hopefully, hopefully we figure this out and move up a couple, a couple places or two. I think that uh, if Snyder can beat Sudalayev, that would be a cherry on top. I mean, that would be yeah. uh, unexpected. But, yeah. you know, just Donnie we're beat Taylor. Him getting that win right at the last, you know, a few seconds kind of reminded me of Gable a little bit, but yeah. you know, I kind of was ah, he lost Bummer and then he got that score, which is pretty neat. Can you, uh, you know, we haven't talked. I don't know if we talked on camera since you guys missed the season last year. I think we've just texted. Um, can you, can you talk a little bit about the RTC and the success and maybe yeah. how not having a season? I'm assuming the RTC was open during that yeah. period. Yeah, we got better. I mean, that's the, that's the interesting thing about the whole situation was that in a time of, you know, real, 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 like, we were facing a lot of adversity. We, we found we found ways to get better. Uh, the, the group stayed together pretty much uh, during the whole time. And, uh, yeah, we got better. So without the RTC, though, and Reese Hopper, we, we would have been, we been in big trouble, uh, basically. Uh, if this were my... Geez, if this were my third year or something like that, we would have we would have real problems, uh, you know, keeping the team together. So that was incredibly um, important for us to be able to do what we did. I mean, I talked to some people that were in a season at the NCAA. Like they, I think they trained less than us. Some of these teams, just with all the COVID protocols and stuff like that. So it was good to have some options to get the training. And not everyone was was in the RTC. Uh, as it goes, but um, there was a pretty good amount. If you want to hear the rest of the interview with Coach Ayers, cruise on over to Rockfin and look it up on my Rockfin channel, True Wrestling on Rockfin. Thanks.